What's going on guys? Welcome back to Industrialized. In this episode, we are going to start on some steel production. We're going to basically take uh, a couple of different approaches to it. I couldn't decide on which approach to do, so I think I'll just take this episode and do both. So we'll be doing the railcraft approach to steel, and we will also be doing the mechanism approach to steel. So first thing we're going to start with is railcraft. So first thing we need apparently is a rolling machine. <coughs> so we need iron, pistons, crafting table. Uh, let's see. Iron. And let's see. Pistons are just iron, wood, and redstone, I think. Cobblestone. I think I have redstone downstairs. I think that's everything. So let's see. Get some of this stuff broken down. I need four pistons. And I can only get two out of this. Wait a minute. How did they? How did that make two pistons when I had no crafting table in my inventory? Or did it make a crafting table? That's weird. Maybe if I put more wood here. Nope, I have no idea. Oh. Stop being a noob. Why does that not work now? Iron. Four pistons. Yeah. Oh, that's because I made pistons last time. That's why. Stupid dummy. Okay, there we go. That makes more sense. Oh, stop it. I don't know why I made four crafting tables. I'm just being an idiot. Don't mind me. Okay. So we have a rolling machine. I'm going to put it down here with this stuff. Uh, I'll put it here. Because it's one of those machines that constantly draws power, so I want it to be able to be turned off. And I think all my conduits are in here. Alright, now we need iron plates. I think it's just iron in a rolling machine, isn't it? Four iron. I think you put the pattern, then you put stuff on top of it. I don't know. Alright, next thing we need 
is a blast furnace. We need magma cream. So we have one here, blaze rods, and I luckily it just so happened that I found a bunch of slimes at the bottom of my stairwell over in the other base where my mine is. So I think there's a slime chunk at the bottom of the stairs because there was like two or three slimes down there. So let's see. Need nine magma cream, so I need. I don't really need that many. That's whatever. That's fine. So there's nine. And we need soul sand, nether brick, blast furnace. I think I need like 36 of these or something. Cool. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> I was like, there's no way I timed that perfectly. Alright. So we're gonna put this up here. So that's be three by three by four high, and it's hollow. So if I put this here. And then let's see. I think I just leave these two hollow. Oh, yes. So now I need. Coal. I could use coal cook, but I'm not using all my coal. I'm saving those so I can never probably use them ever. I'm only using those coal for stuff that I can't use charcoal for. What was I looking for? Oh yeah, plates. Let's just craft that one too. Alright. I will turn this off. And this should slowly drain. So now if we put these here, these here, I don't know how much charcoal this is going to take, probably take a ton. And it's probably going to take a long time to smelt this, so. Next thing we need to do is the uh, what is it called? Brain fart mechanism. We need to make the mechanism stuff. So I set that up in a test world. It shouldn't be too bad. And as you can see, I have tons of updates that I need to install, but I don't really know if I really want to install them because I'm just afraid that I'm going to get stuck like last season where stuff breaks and I can't continue so I just want to continue what I'm doing right now until I kind of hit a wall so let's see we need metallurgic infuser which I think takes quite a few things let's put the this is getting pretty full This is kind of like my mob drop thing. Can't wait to get like AE, an AE system. Uh, let's see. So we need to look up metallurgic infuser. Iron is easy, furnace is easy. This is pretty easy, and that's pretty easy. So I just need three enriched alloys which is enriched iron, 
That's not too bad. I need dirt. I don't know if this will cook in. I don't know if this uses vanilla recipes or not. I think this stuff does. Let's take half a stack. I should do three at a time. Yep, I get six, nice. So then I take this and this and these. Put these in here. Let's make more of these. And then we should get those round thingies, these. I need redstone, I have redstone, good. One. Okay, so, no, I can't do it here. I don't have a crafting table here. Ooh, one more. I need to make the uh, exact portable crafting table. Big time. So I need two chips. I need two furnaces. Alright, shift click on that question mark is like makes life so much easier. Uh, let's see. I need some more of those painted uh, facades for the Ender IO cables. I think I have some here. Who was it? That one? Hey, look at all these. It's definitely a snowplow outside. And there's one. I only need one. Alright, I think that's it. I don't really want to put it here, but I will for now. I don't know if I want to have like and Ryo stuff here, and then like, well, I don't leave enough room to spread everything around, so let's go with this for now. Put this here, put this here, put this here. Looks a little out of place, but whatevs. Now we need. How does that go? I think it's. Iron and charcoal. I don't think I need a lot. Take this anyway. three in there it fills up that little thing there and then we put let's put three iron in here I don't think that's right oh it's enriched iron that's right oh And then I just smelt that into steel. All right. Cha Ching. 
So there's our steel. That was pretty quick. Uh, yeah. This is probably not even near done. Uh, it's actually doing pretty good. Oh, that uses a lot of more charcoal, though. I'm probably end up not using this, but... Meh. And let's see. What other things can we make with this? I don't know what half the stuff even does. Oh, we can make bronze with this copper tin powder. That's cool. That's a lot easier probably than using tinkers. Bronze, refined, obsidian, dust. Bronze, bronze. Refined obsidian, you can make mossy stone with biofuel apparently. Steel, of course. Cool. I don't know what this does. I don't know what this does. I don't know if this is how you can put like a battery to charge this up or something. I don't know. Alright. So I think this one should be just about done. So these are different mods, obviously, but they should still work together. So that's our steel production. The last thing I want to do in this episode is use up some of my XP to enchant a book. No, that seems kind of random, but... In case I die... Abra. I use 26. Do I not have enough books here? Eh, I don't care. I'm not going to use this stuff anyway. Efficiency 3. What else do I have here? I'm breaking 3. Efficiency 3. Efficiency 3. Not bad, Doc. If. Or should I say GIF? Alright. So I think that's it for this episode. On the next episode, we are going to put the steel to use. And we're going to finally get some more power going down in the basement with the hydrogen generator. I really don't know where I'm going to put it yet. Probably, well... Probably, 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 yeah, I don't know. Be nice to tie it into this. Um, yeah, about that. Kind of want to put it over here, but then it's not really a big machine, so. I can probably put it down here, but I want to reserve this for these. Uh, yeah, I'll have to think of something. But it shouldn't be too hard, especially with the, the steel I have now. Um, so yeah, see you next time.